All right, Pet Man Matt Morrow, Charlotte Football Insiders, welcome back to the Players Lounge. We got a really talented 2026 athlete here with us tonight in the Players Lounge. That's Cameron Melvin from Cleveland High School. Cameron, how you doing, man? Good. How about you? Man, I'm doing great. I appreciate you taking some time out of your busy schedule with us. I know you just went on a visit. Um, can you tell us a little bit about that before we get started? The visit was great to West Virginia. I learned a lot. Uh, showed me around. Uh, treated me good. Everything. Good stuff, man. Well, you see your highlights right here. You see why West Virginia's interested. You're just creating havoc on defense right here at the linebacker spot coming off the edge making big tackles but let's get to know you a little bit cameron so first of all what inspired you to start playing football in the first place i just like the like i just like watching them hit you know i like <laughs> uh so did you start when you were younger youth league thing like anything like that yes i started when i was like eight okay all right, good stuff, man. Um, so, obviously, an athlete, you do a lot of different things on the football field. But in your opinion, what are some, what are the best things you do on the football field right now? Hitting. <laughs> There's something about contact that you just love, huh? Yeah, I like having a headache. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's smoking like a, uh, a true athlete on both sides of the ball. So... On offense, you know, you do you like doling out, you know, big hits when you have the ball in your hands? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Good stuff, man. Well, how big are you? What's your size? Uh, two fifteen right now. Oh wow, uh, two fifteen. That's impressive as a freshman. Well, rising sophomore now, but six yeah, foot. Yeah, that's awesome, man. Um, obviously, you just went on a visit to West Virginia. So, uh, what other schools are you interested in playing um, football on, um, in, up, on, uh, up in college? <laughs> Any school that's going to get me better for the next level. Really. Okay. So, I know you got some couple – you got interest from a lot of different schools right now. Uh, yes, sir. What, what are some of those schools? Is it Penn State, uh, Notre Dame, uh, Michigan. They didn't say it really. Oh, well, those are some big schools. <laughs> if those schools are interested in you now, I'm mm -hmm. sure there's going to be plenty more in your future, man. That's awesome. Uh, so far in your career, what's your best memory playing football? Can you repeat that again? Yeah, so far in your football career, what's your best memory playing football? When I first ran somebody over. Oh, wow. Okay. Can you, you remember the play? What, what happened on it? I was like a little drill. Oh, okay. Okay. Nice, man. I know everybody was like, ooh, you know, all yeah, that. That was good. <laughs> That's awesome, man. Um, so going into your sophomore year, what are some goals you have for yourself this year? Uh, I want to get faster. Uh, learn more of the fundamental things about football feet our middle school. Hey, yeah. those like you had to use your brain for it. I was just a bronze. Absolutely, man. You know, being just a freshman, you're right. There's still a lot to learn about the game. And um, that's good. That's a good. Those are good, solid goals to have. Um, who would you like to thank in your life for your football success so far? My mom and dad. Absolutely. Now, did your dad get you into football? Is that how you kind of got introduced to it? Yeah, a little bit. But he wasn't so much of a football fan himself. So played basketball. Oh. oh, okay. Do you play basketball too? I can do a little something on the court every once. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good, man. That's good. Um, so away from the game, away from the field, what are some things you like to do um, in your spare time? I like to work out. Uh, swim. Hang out with them. Really. Pretty simple dude, huh? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, good. Good, man. That's a good way to be. Um, we talked about some of the good things you've done, but what is something you want to improve on uh this upcoming season? Improve on really everything. Okay. You can always work on your craft. 
Absolutely. You know, you talk about lifting weights in the off season. That's that's a good thing. Do you work out with a trainer or anything like that? Yes, sir. Okay. Awesome. Good stuff, man. Uh, so far in your career, who is or has been your favorite football coach um, that's kind of guided you to where you are? Mm. Probably be my coach right now, Coach Riley. Okay. The whole, the whole coaching staff, really. Good. Hey, what what makes them special in your um, development? They just they work with you about stuff on the field and off the field. If you have any issues off the field, you can come to them, talk about it. Especially Coach Hughes. Awesome. It's always good to have you know that kind of source there in your life because things do get tough sometimes. Yeah. Awesome, man. All right. Um, our last question for you, Cam. Um, what are some things you do to get mentally and physically ready before a football game? You go out and start laying people out. <laughs> <laughs> Listen to uh, Chief Keith and, you know, just vibe. Okay. I, I, I don't know who Chief Keith is, but I'm sure <laughs> he's got the right stuff to get you mentally focused. Yeah, uh, get you out. hurt. <laughs> now that I do know I knew though a little bit about that so that's good stuff man uh, Cam obviously you're one of the best uh, 2026 players in the state uh, we've got you ranked very high on prep red zone um, in North Carolina and um, I think this is just the start for you and you, obviously you got some big schools interested in you uh, we appreciate your time man we look forward to covering you over the next couple of years and doing big things on the football field yes sir Appreciate it, man. Appreciate you. Absolutely.